One of the questions I often get asked by customers is how can I display the original invoice number when issuing a credit note to a customer? This functionality exists natively within Dynamics 365 for Finance. To do this, we have one key parameter that exists under Accounts Receivable, Setup, Accounts Receivable Parameters. Under the Update tab, we have this Invoice section and then here we have apply credit inv invoicing layout into sales and project invoice reports. By well, toggling this to yes, you're going to see that the original invoice number, along with the reason for the credit note, will print on the document, the credit note itself, by default. This will apply to free text invoices, sales order invoices, as well as project invoices. Let's go ahead and look at an example. For my example, I'm going to use a sales order. So let me go into my all sales orders. I'm going to use this order 1114. And I'm going to issue a credit note for this order. To do that, we do it the same way we normally would. Under the cell tab, I click credit note. I choose the order. Here it is. And I can choose multiple lines or a single line in this section if I wanted to. In my case, this is a one line order, so I can simply collect the header. And then up here under reason code, I will say it is for miscellaneous reasons and service provided was insufficient. That's why I'm doing my credit note. Now note this will work if you use the full RMA process as well. In my case, I'm doing a service item, so I will be issuing the credit note directly from here. I don't need to do any sort of pick and pack, so I'm going to go straight to generating the invoice. And I will do that right now. Now, in this case, an invoice is a credit note, and you will see what happens right here. So when this prints, what you'll see is that there are two fields that are not available on the sales order by default. That is the corrected invoice. And you can see originally this was order number or invoice number 726, which was issued on July 20th. And then my reason was what I just provided and there's the $90 that I am returning to the customer. And so all of that prints by default automatically. If you want to see, if I click on this journal's invoice, you can see there's my original invoice number, 726, as we saw, and here's my credit note, credit note number three. Thank you for watching this video.